Today's video is going to be about how to install a pull down chain light fixture. I'm going to show you step by step how to do it. I hope you follow through, watch the video to the end. I'm confident you will save time and money. This particular lamp holder with pull chain broke. The chain snapped and stayed inside. So there's no way to get the chain out until I remove it. So what I want to do with this video is I want to show you how to do it. If you have the same situation or for whatever reason, your lamp holder or your light fixture that has a pull chain or any other type that doesn't work or stop working, this is what you want to do. I want to give you a simple instruction, but first you start off with turning off all the circuitry, like a switch off. It's better if you could go downstairs or or upstairs whatever you have your circuit breaker panel if you could turn off the circuit breaker for this circuit uh, it'll be better for you it'll be safer for you so once you have that established you go ahead and take this two screw off so you take a box cutter knife or a screwdriver like in myself and you just circle around it it's only two wires in some cases there's a three wire the green one however i only have the white wire and the black one white is your uh, common wire and the black is your hot wire so i'm going to put it back exactly how i found it so now what i want to do is i want to fix these wires you see it originally was installed with a with the wire going around the screw so i'm just going to cut it off just a bit because i don't need it that long for me to slide it right into this new fixture it'll be easy for me to do that so i'm going to do this for the black wire and the white wire you see this right here this is bronze right here that's where the hot wire go and the silver side is for the white wire um so you have some uniformity over here just if you just follow these simple rules so you see the system here all i had to do is slide the wire in place and tighten up the screw i love this system and it worked very well in the past and i'm sure it'll work good this time now i'm going to do same for the white wire slide it in where the silver nut is and just make sure it's tight you don't want it to come loose so now we are ready to install this back into the original two mounting screw so in this case i like the fact that it has the sliding fixture in place and you tighten up the screw where the mounting screw is sometimes that screw is stripped or the head is broken fixture comes with extra screws that you could install so you need one i like to put new ones there usually but in this case i want to save those screw for some other purpose because these screws were in good condition so uh, i decided to leave that in place now we finally got to the last step which is to install the light bulb I decided to use the energy efficient one and now you test it it comes on fine your job is done if you find this video useful, please don't forget to like and subscribe to the channel. Thank you for watching.